Good morning, Rock Spring Elementary. Attention, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Attention, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the Georgia flag and to the principles for which it stands, wisdom, justice, and moderation. Good morning. Today is Tuesday, February 6th. For lunch on Wednesday, we will be having spaghetti or fish nuggets. We only have one birthday, and it's Savannah Dags. Hey, that's me. Happy birthday. Don't, just remember to feed the monsters, bring in all the box stops. Be here every day by 745. Don't be tardy. Good morning, Rockets. Today is Tuesday, and we have a special Friday Fanatics. I know we usually do it on Monday, but today we're doing it on Tuesday. So let's get right to business. Friday Fanatics from February the 2nd are in Miss Bethune's room, Beckham Scepter. You are a Friday Fanatic. You are a Friday fanatic because you've worked hard on listening and following directions and you have knocked out your goal by writing your name. Great job, Beckham. In Miss Oliver's class, our Friday fanatic is Hunter Franklin. He has been a good friend. He can write the letters of his name. Awesome job, Hunter. Going to kindergarten in Miss Key's class, our Friday fanatic is Aiden Holcomb. Aiden is sounding out words in his writing. Great job, Aiden. In Miss Wiggly's room, Summer Ray, you are a Friday fanatic. You are a Friday fanatic because you've done a great job sounding out long and short vowel words and participating in group reading activities. Great job, Summer. And Miss Williams, Lexi Daniel, you are a Friday fanatic because you excel at remembering vocabulary words and you can give example of those words. Great job, Lexi. Moving on to first grade in Miss Douglas's class, Brooklyn Wilson, you are a Friday fanatic. You always have a positive attitude in writing and always has a smile to share. So great job, Brooklyn. In Miss Hayes' classroom, her Friday fanatic is Juliana Howard. She has mastered all of the sight word lists. Sounds like she's knocked out a goal to me. Great job. In Miss Shook's room, Kylie Vergara, you are a Friday fanatic for working hard and speaking kindly to others. Great job. Moving on to second grade, Miss Case's room, Anthony Furahammer. You are a Friday fanatic because you are super enthusiastic about learning. You are always participating and you love to learn. Great job, Anthony. Keep up the good work. In Miss Evans' classroom, Jake Gruber. You are a Friday fanatic. Jake comes in smiling every morning with a happy greeting. He stays focused on his work. He is showing great modeling techniques and three-digit addition in math. Great job, Jake. In Miss Kistner's room, Morgan Thurman is our Friday fanatic. Morgan is always willing to help others, and she is always polite to peers and adults in and out of the classroom. Great job, Morgan. Moving on to third grade. In Miss Jones' room, Friday Fanatic is Addison McNabb. Addison knocked out her spelling goal by missing only one out of 30 words. Awesome job, Addison. In Miss Claghorn's room, our Friday Fanatic is Harrison Gilstrap. Harrison has met his reading level goal to a level P. Way to, way to knock out your goal, Harrison. Great job. In Miss Watts' room, Emma Edgeworth, you are a Friday fanatic. 
Emma met her spelling goal by getting 30 words correct out of a total of 30 words. Wow, 100%. Great job, Emma. Moving on to fourth grade in Miss Burdett's room. Mackenzie Carden, you are a Friday fanatic. You participate and work hard in math to understand fractions. You are showing mastery in fractions. Sounds like you're getting ready to meet your goal too, Mackenzie. Great job. In Miss Dawson's room, Zoe Cordell, you have you are a Friday fanatic by paying attention in class, working hard, and does her best on every assignment. Great attitude and always kind and helpful. Good job, Zoe. Moving to fifth grade, in Miss Cobb's room, Cooper Kelly, you are a Friday fanatic. You're a very good student and you work hard and make great choices. Great job, Cooper. In Miss Milliken's room, Drew McGill, you are a Friday fanatic. Drew has been doing a great job making good choices and remembering to use self-control. Great job, Drew, I'm proud of you. In Miss Reynolds' room, Savannah Diggs, you are a Friday fanatic for always working hard, helping others, and is a student helper in pre-K. So great job, Savannah. These are our Friday fanatics, and I'm so proud of them, each and every one, and I know that you can be a Friday fanatic too, so work hard, Rockets. Hello, Rockets. Today's a big day. That's right, it's an exciting day. Have you heard what's tonight? You haven't? Well, let me tell you, it is the Rock Spring Talent Show. You will want to be here. Some of your friends are participating in the talent show and you need to come out and support them. Make sure you are here. We will have some special guests in the building that night that may do something in our talent show. So you will want to make sure you are here. I'm so excited. If you knew the little secret, you would be excited too. So make sure you're here tonight. It begins at 6.30. PTO is putting on this talent show. They'll have snacks available to purchase, but we're so excited. I got a sneak peek of the talent show Friday afternoon. We've got some talented kids, so you will want to be there. I know I'm going to be there. 6.30 tonight. It is the mission of Walker County Schools to ensure all students graduate ready for college, ready for work, ready for life. Rock Spring and beyond. Rockets, don't forget to have a great day. Work hard, give 100%, and you know, be awesome.